I think if we look at it in, in the broadest spectrum, um, there's obviously certain skills and knowledge the trader will need, uh, whether it be technicals, fundamentals, market knowledge, down to using their systems. So that's one broad category. Uh, then I would suggest that the next one's probably uh, a trading strategy of, of some sort, uh, whether that be very explicit and very formalised or much more kind of in their own mind and maybe more discretionary. Once you've got skills and strategy, then probably from my perspective, we, we get into uh, what I think is the interesting thing, which is you need the psychology, which then allows you to be able to actually get the best out of those skills and, and strategy. So uh, in there would have things like um, certainly a motivation is really important. Uh, focus is going to be an important characteristic. Everyone talks in trading about discipline. Um, mm -hmm. So, you know, having your plan and following through with the plan. I, I've got some probably slightly different views on that to, to most people, but that's probably uh, an important one. Um, I mean, other key things are important around mindset. I think you've got to have an appetite for some kind of risk. You've got to be happy with risk, uncertainty. But uh, can these things be taught or are they already things that are there that you just kind of bring in through? Well, I think they, well, they can be taught. I mean, obviously, I have to believe that because that's what I do for my <laughs> living. So uh, I believe they can be taught. But does it sound, well, no, but I mean, you're doing this for your living, but yeah. is it something you say you, you're bringing that through in that person and building on something they've already got that they don't know about? Yeah. Or is it literally, I mean, or do people just not have it? It's like instinct, do you yeah. know what I mean? No, it's a bit of both. So if we, if we think about um, who we are as people, we're a combination of three key things, genetics, experience and the environments we've been in so over our life and over our trading lives we've got some genetic predispositions and then the rest of it really is down to experience and environment so the brain is shaped through those three aspects so by giving people certain experiences and in certain environments we can shape the brain so we can develop the skills and characteristics that we want people to have so uh, and that's what we're trying to do really in trading and, and in my role in trading psychology is try and give people the experiences teach them the skills or the processes to actually shape the brain to give them the skills they need so i think about uh, not so much personality but our styles of doing things or the skills we've got um, which then you know has a much more uh, pliable much more sort of plasticity to it that we can develop these things so yeah they definitely can be taught but people may have a higher level of them to start off with than other people.